We're going to uh, have a look at borders now, and we haven't spent a lot of time in class or within the book looking at these things, but they can be used to, for dramatic effect. In fact, some of the uh, circular buttons that you'll find are created by enlarging the four borders with a radius so that they become a circle. But let's firstly look at the colour of the main aside. So if we come over to here and we click on the aside itself, we can see that the code navigator comes up. And then when we move down, you can have a look at what kind of effects are being done here. So we can see that, for example, on the main aside, there is a color border bottom that's three pixels and the color is 069 and 069 border top. So there's only two borders, top and bottom. So let's have a look at that in the code. Uh, main aside, so let's look at the CS and we should find it down here. Main aside, if we show the set, Hopefully it'll come up with the borders. There's the thing that shows the background color. The border, I think, was top and bottom. And sure enough, there's the blue border. And there's the border for the bottom. So we're going to change that 0, 6, 9 for 1 from our color palette. Coming back to my color again. I think I colored this salmon, so I'm going to use that green color. Remember, I can always change my mind about these later. So I'm copying that. Then I come back to the border bottom. I'm going to change the border top. And if we look at that, yep, it's all changed. So I'm just going to save that in the style sheet and close it. 